Hi guys, choosing a laptop in 30 to 40 thousand rupee budget is such a daunting task. Reason number one is you get so many options available plus the second reason is there are these big sales. For example, Amazon has launched their great Indian festival. Flipkart is coming up with their big billion day sale and these sales are going to keep pestering you all the way till Christmas and New Year. So if you want to buy a good laptop in this particular winter season, then make sure to watch this video carefully because today I'll suggest you what laptops you can buy and more importantly, what kind of laptops that you need to avoid. All right, let's start the video here with the option number one. Option number one comes with HP and the first thing that striked me about this particular laptop is the look. Oh boy, this is brushed aluminum finish. The keyboard is very large with numeric keypad plus it is backlit. Yes guys, it is backlit. You can read all of these specifications. The links are available in the description or in the first comment. You can go ahead and read it. Today we are not going to read those specs. All right, that is boring. We are going to highlight the points why you need to buy this laptop or why you need to avoid this laptop. All right. So as you can see, it comes with a large display. This is 15.6 inch full HD, thin bezels, very good looks. The CPU is latest Intel's 12th generation core i3-1215U. Now this particular CPU is based on the big little architecture because it comes with two performance cores, all right, and four power efficient cores. The total turbo frequency is also pretty healthy. Apart from that, the laptop comes with a eight 8, gig, 8 gigs of DDR4 RAM, 512 GB SSD Intel onboard graphics. It is in thin and light category, 1.69 kg. And there's the usual bundle of Windows 11 and Microsoft Office. This thing is listed for 38, 39,000 before discount, but using your debit card and credit card offers, hopefully you can get this around till 35 or 36,000. At that price point, this thing is going to be a very good option. Let's take a look at the option number two. This is the younger brother of the very same thing and this thing is pretty much cheaper. So the reason I'm showing you this particular laptop is that this thing is a trap. Why? Because it comes with 11th generation Intel Core i3 CPU. I do not particularly like this CPU because it's really weak. As you can see over here, it comes with two cores and four thread. It is a much older design and I do not generally prefer this kind of older generation CPU. It does appear cheaper and this is the reason that many people fall for this kind of laptop. So what I will suggest is you add a few uh, thousand or two thousand bucks and you go for this thing using card discount you will be able to get it till 36,000. So make sure you avoid this older generation CPUs and this is the common trap that many people fall for. Let's move ahead to the next option and the next option over here is Honor Magic Book. X14. This is a compact laptop, you know, 14 inch screen size, very good, very portable for traveling. It comes with 12th generation Intel Core i5 and this is 12450H. H means that this is a high performance CPU as you can see over here. It comes with four high performance threads and four power efficient threads. So the performance quotient has gone up. All right. The max turbo frequency is also pretty healthy. Rest of the specifications are also very good. The display is pretty nice. You can see it comes with full HD resolution. Let's take a look at the overall design. As you can see, this is very professional, very nice, sleek looking laptops. It comes with eight gigs of RAM, the usual 512 GB SSD. The display is anti-glare panel IPS. That's again good. And this comes with Windows 11. It's not mentioned regarding the Microsoft Office. You can anyways get open office or something like that and you can use it. So it's not a huge problem. Uh, being a 14 inch laptop, the focus on portability is definitely highlighted because the weight of this laptop is 1.43 kg. Pricing is also pretty good around 42,000 using the card discount and variety of coupons. If you get this laptop for say around 40,000 rupees, it's going to be a very good buy. And yes, guys, I need to remind you that affiliate buying links for all of these laptops are available in this video's description or in the first comment. If you want to support my channel, make sure whenever you buy this kind of laptop, absolutely use my provided affiliate links. Let's move on to the next option. Now here we are at the team red. Yes, this is Ryzen 5 5500U. The looks is similar to the earlier ones that we saw. So we are not going to discuss on the looks. What I'm going to discuss is why you should avoid this laptop. All right. The first thing is that the pricing of this laptop is pretty high. This thing is 40,000 rupees before discount. So what I'll do is I'll simply provide a better option to you. And the better option here comes from Dell. 
this thing is priced at a very competitive 36000 rupees before discounts after discounts you will get this for around 33 34 at that time it's a very sweet buy let's talk about the specification so this is amd ryzen 55500u and this thing comes with 6 cores 12 threads and here uh, amd is not using that uh, big little architecture so all of these cores you can see are high performance core so the performance of this particular laptop is going to be pretty good the ram is 8 gigabytes 512 gb ssd 14 inch full hd display the usual windows 11 and microsoft office bundle again the weight is very much in control 1.48 kg and overall look and design of this laptop is very professional very nice looking so i'll suggest that compared to the hp option you should go for this there is only one thing lacking in this particular option that is the backlight keyboard the hp model used to come with a backlit keyboard so if that is your priority maybe you will have to spend 4 4000 rupees extra but if i were in your place i would have simply gone for this one saving 4000 rupees is pretty good and you forgo the backlit keyboard but rest of the specifications are pretty good let's talk about another laptop this is from asus or asus whatever you call it all right this is the k14 oled panel and at this point you might be thinking sir why is this 2021 laptop with such an outdated i3 11th generation cpu doing in your list all right we'll come to that in a moment first let's talk about the highlight points of this laptop so this thing comes with an oled panel the display is uh, very good the intel cpu is i3 11154g this is a very weak cpu it comes with only two cores four threads turbo frequency is all right but the count of cores is not very satisfactory it comes with the usual 8 gb of ram 512 gb of ssd so no complaints over here windows and microsoft office is also fine weight is all right considering this is a large 15.6 inch display so what is this outdated laptop doing in my list all right so this laptop is being recommended only for a very particular set of audience so if your usage for laptop is only for content consumption all right if you love watching youtube all day if you love watching lots of movies if you love watching documentaries you don't care much about the performance because see this kind of cpu it is fine for regular browsing it's fine for youtube it's going to do all of your work from home tasks all right it's going to do all of your presentations and everything but don't expect this laptop to you know help you game or edit so if your target is to consume content then this thing below 40000 can be a very good option all right so this thing is listed at 42 apply your card discounts if you get it at 40000 and if you watch youtube all day maybe you can go for this thing but keep in mind that the cpu is a little older all right now let's come to the last part or you can say my favorite part of this particular video this is msi modern 15 amd ryzen 5 the very latest 7530u this cpu comes with 6 cores 12 threads very fast turbo frequency up to 4.5 gigahertz the cache levels are also very healthy again i'll provide links to all of these charts in the description so you can you can go ahead and check them out now the looks of this laptop oh boy i mean look at this jet black piano finish large keyboard all right plethora of ports including usb type c and the keyboard is also backlit so i think that all of the requirements have been fulfilled by this particular laptop cpu is very good looks are pretty good large keyboard large display all right so everything is very nice 8 gigs of ram 512 gb ssd the usual windows 11 home weight is also manageable 1.7 kg for a 15 inch laptop it's all right and i think that in this particular sale if i had to buy a particular laptop this is the one thing that i'm going to buy anyways all of the buying links for variety of models have been provided in the description below you can choose any one which you like if you want to see more of these buying guides with respect to other types of laptops for example high end laptops or gaming laptops then there will be a bunch of cards popping up on your screen like this you can click on them and check those informative videos as well so that's it for this neat little video guys take care and have a nice day